Hello, my name is Vicki Scott. I've been a physician assistant for 22 years. Today I'm going to be demonstrating a complete physical exam for you. In your physical diagnosis course, you'll be learning each of the components of the physical exam you see on this video. At the end of the course, you're going to be expected to demonstrate your skills for your instructor. We hope that this video will provide you with an overview and introduction to the skills that you'll be learning over the next several months. Mr. Allen, huh. my name is Vicki Scott. I'm a physician assistant and nice I'll be doing a complete exam on you today. Okay. And you know, if you have any questions as we go along, feel free to, to ask. Okay, great. I'm just going to start with a set of vital signs. I'm sure you've had that before. So I'm going to do a blood pressure first. And we're actually going to do two. Okay. I'll start on this side. I'm just going to lift your arm up a little bit here. That's good. 112 over 76. I'm just going to come over on the other side. Okay, it's about the same on this side. It's nice to know I'm symmetrical. Yes. Okay, now I'm just going to take, take your pulse. Okay, and I was also counting your respirations while I was doing that. Okay, I'm going to kind of go from head to toe at this point. So just taking a look at your face and looking to see that it looks symmetric. And now I just want to check your, your head and your hair. And um, I'm going to ask you to do some face movements along with me to check the muscles in your face. Okay. So can you wrinkle your forehead for me? Oh, great. Excellent. Okay, can you close your eyes really tight and keep them closed. Don't let me open them. Excellent. Very good. Okay, you can open them. And puff out your cheeks for me. Okay, and smile a little bit. Okay, good. And can you brown? Okay, great. Excellent. Um, and I'm... Can you open your mouth for me? Open and close. Open and close. Great. OK. Um, I'm going to check the sensation in your face now. And I'm going to check a couple of different ways. Um, one is I'm going to touch you with a little bit of a sharp mm -hmm. point. And I want you to tell me if it feels sharp or dull. OK. okay? So if you close your eyes for me, and you just say sharp or dull when you feel something. Sharp. Okay. Sharp. 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 That was dull. Okay. Oops, sharp. Sorry. Sharp. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, and now I'm going to do the same thing, um, just with a little little cotton wisp. Okay. So it's just going to feel kind of like that. Okay. And Good, you got your eyes closed. And just say yes when you feel something. Yes. 
Yes. Yes. Yes. Yes. Yes. Very good. Okay. And I'm going to do your ear and eye exam next. Okay. okay. And I just want to take a look at your ears. And any any tenderness there? No. How about it? How about over here? Okay. Okay. And um, I'm going to take a look in your ears. It's my ancient otoscope. <laughs> and that looks good. I'm going to come around the other side. I'm going to check your hearing now, and I'm just going to cover up this ear. And can you hear this? Mm -hmm. Tell me when you can't hear it anymore. Now. Okay. Same thing on the other side. Can you hear this? Mm -hmm. Tell me when you can't hear it anymore. Now. Good. Okay. Now this is another little hearing test, okay. and I'm going to place this on top of your head. Mm -hmm. Can you hear that? Mm -hmm. Does it sound about the same on both sides? I think so, yes. Okay. Now we're going to do the same thing, but just behind your ear. Can you hear that? Yes. Tell me when you can't hear it anymore. No. Can you hear it now? Yes. Okay. We're going to do the same thing on the other side. Can you hear that? Mm-hmm. Tell me when you can't hear it anymore. No. Can you hear it yes. now? Okay, great. Okay, now we're going to start with your eyes. And I'm just taking a look at your brows and your, your eyelids. And um, I'm going to take a look at your, the rest of your eyes here, okay? And um, I want to just check your vision. Do you normally wear glasses no. for reading? No. Okay, so I want you to just hold this in whatever hand feels comfortable okay. to you. I'm going to hold it about that far away. All right. And can you read this line of numbers for me? Yes. 937. Eight two six. Okay. Now I want you to cover one eye. Okay. And can you read this line backwards? Six two six two eight seven three nine. Okay, good. Now cover the other eye. Okay. And read this line forward. Uh, okay. Nine three seven eight two six. Very good. Okay. Okay, I want you to just follow my finger with your eyes and keep your head still. Okay. Okay? Very good. Okay. This time I want you to just look straight at me. Okay. And I'm going to be wiggling my fingers in various places beside okay. your head. And as soon as you're able to see them on either side, I want you to lift up your finger on that side okay. to show me that you can see it. Okay. okay? So just look straight at me. Okay, very good. Good. Very good. Okay. Okay, we're just going to check your pupils now. I want you to look right at my nose. Okay. Great. And I want you to just look straight ahead at me. Great. I'm just going to shine this light from the side. Okay. All right. I just want you to look at my finger and watch as it comes in toward you. I'm going to make you cross-eyed. <laughs> okay. Very good. And um, now I'd like you to look at a point at the door okay. over there and just focus on that. And now look at my finger. Very good. And look back at the door. Okay, great. 
I'm just going to check your tear glands there and here. Good. All right. Normally, we would turn the lights off for this part of the exam, but for purposes of demonstration, we're going to leave them on. Okay, Mr. Allen, I'd like you to just look at the distant point over there, and I'm going to be shining this light in your eye. So just try and hold your head still for me. Okay, very good. Now I'm going to do the same thing on the other side. Same point. Same point. Okay. I'm going to examine your nose now. Okay. And uh, I want to check your sinuses first and just see if you have any tenderness when I press over these areas? Any of that hurt? No. Nope. How about when I press up here? No. That doesn't hurt. Okay. And I want to just check and see if your nasal passages are open. So if you just close off one nostril and breathe in. Okay. And the other side. Very good. Okay. I'm going to test your sense of smell now. And I've got these nice, pleasant aromas that I want you to mm -hmm. to tell me what they are. Okay. So um, again, I want you to just close off one nostril. Okay. And why don't you close your eyes for me, too. And just breathe in a little bit and tell me if you smell something and what it is. It smells like coffee. OK, very good. And now the other side. Again. It smells like cinnamon. Very good. Exactly right. I'm just going to take a look inside your nose now. You can just tilt your head a little bit for me. Very good. Okay. Very good. All right, I'd like to just examine your mouth now. Okay. And uh, can you open up for me a little bit? Good. Excellent. Can you lift up your tongue for me? Great. OK, now stick your tongue out and put it over to the side and the other side. Very good. OK, now open up again and say, ah. Ah. Uh. OK, sorry. Sorry. All right, let me just check your neck now. I'm just looking at your thyroid gland, and I want to check your trachea. Okay. And uh, I'm going to check your lymph nodes. I'm going to check your thyroid now. Mm -hmm. So I want you to just hold on to that. And I'm going to ask you to swallow a couple of times. So okay. why don't you just take a little water in your mm -hmm. mouth and don't swallow yet. OK, swallow. Great. OK. All right, that's fine. Now we're going to just do some neck movements together, OK? So I want you to touch your chin to your chest. Very good. And all the way back. Good. And now back toward me. And just ear down to your shoulder. And the other way. Very good. Now chin to your shoulder. And the other side. Excellent. Very good. OK. And I'm just checking the the contour in the back there. Okay. 
Now I want you to um, just push against my hand. Push me away. Okay, very good. And the other side, push me away. Very good. And shrug your shoulders up and just hold them up. Don't let me push them down. Very good. Mr. Allen, I'm going to take a look at your back now. Just to undo your gown and okay. let's just let that, let that down. I'm just looking for symmetry. I'm looking at um, your breathing effort. And take a nice deep breath in for me. Good. And another one. Very good. Okay, I'm going to just push on your back and tell me if any of this hurts. All feels okay? Yep. Okay. How about over here? That all feels all right? Yep. Okay. I'm just going to pound on your back here for a second. Does that hurt? No, feels good. How about that? No. Good. I'm going to touch you at various points on your back, and when you feel me touch you, I want you to say 99. Okay. Just cross your arms in front for a little okay. bit. Okay. 99. 99. 99. Very good. Okay. Now I'm going to tap on your back a little bit. I'm going to check your diaphragms. So what I'd like you to do is take a deep breath in and let all your air out and hold it. Okay. Okay? So whenever you're ready. Put it all out. Okay, you can go ahead and breathe. I'm just going to make a little, little mark on you here. Okay. Now I want you to take a deep breath in and hold it. Okay. You can breathe. I'm just going to measure that. Looks like it's just about five centimeters. Now I'm going to do the same thing on the other side. So again, I want you to take a deep breath in and let it all out and yeah. hold it. Great. Okay. You can breathe. Now take a deep breath in and hold it. Can breathe. And again, I'm going to measure that distance. And it's just under five centimeters. Okay, very good. Now I'm going to take a listen to your lungs. So when you feel me touch you with the stethoscope, mm -hmm. I want you to just take a nice deep breath through your mouth, in okay. and out. Okay? Go ahead. Let me know if you get a little lightheaded. Okay. 
Okay, just one more. Okay, very good. Okay. Let's get you covered up again. Okay, Mr. Allen, I'm going to check the lymph nodes under your arms now. Okay. okay? So I'm, I'm just going to let this gown down again, okay. if you don't mind. And um, what I want you to do is just, just rest your arm on my shoulder. And I'm going to reach up really deep into your armpit here. Okay. Just try and relax your arm. That's great. OK, very good. Let's do the same thing on the other side. Just try and relax your arm. going to have you lie down. Okay. All right. Just going to get you covered up here. We're going to lower this gown again. All right. And again, I'm just looking at your chest wall. And um, why don't you take another deep breath for me? Good. And again. Press on you and tell me if this hurts. That doesn't hurt at all. Mm -hmm. How about when I press like this? No. Okay. Over here, or here. Good. Okay. Again, we're gonna I'm gonna touch you in a few places and I want you to say ninety-nine when I touch okay. you. Ninety-nine. 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 Very good. And I'm going to just tap on you a little bit. Okay. And I'm going to take a listen. So, some nice deep breaths again. Your mouth open? Okay. One more time. Good. Okay. I'm just going to shine a light now on your neck. And I'm just looking in this area at your carotid pulse. and the venous pulsations. And I tried to measure these if they looked elevated. And we would measure them just like that. Okay. I'm going to check your carotid pulse. 